वेलकम टू एपिसोड नंबर टू ऑफ एडवांस एक्सेल फॉर विजुअली एम्पायर्ड एंड बाय एक्सेसिबल कंप्यूटिंग यूट्यूब चैनल एक्सेसिबल कंप्यूटिंग एक्सेस टू टेक्नोलॉजी विद एक्सेसिबिलिटी हाय फ्रेंड्स दिस इज योर टेक फ्रेंड रातुल टुडे वी आर गोइंग टू लर्न अबाउट द शीट्स हाउ टू रिनेम ऑल द शीट्स हाउ टू डिलीट एनी शीट्स हाउ टू इंसर्ट एन न्यू शीट्स एवरीथिंग अबाउट शीट्स टुडे वी आर गोइंग टू लर्न सो लेट मी ओपन एन एक्सेल I have opened an Excel file and blank Excel file. So we know that Excel has three sheets. If you are using Microsoft Office 2010, 13, or 16, 16 and above, you have only one sheet. Okay, so I have only one sheet. To insert a new sheet, you have to press Shift plus F11. Shift plus F11 is the shortcut key to insert a new sheets. I am pressing sheet two table one. Sheet two, sheet two has been inserted at the current point view or at the current point, which means if you are in sheet one, sheet two will be inserted before sheet one, not after sheet one. To navigating between sheets, you have to use Control page up and page down key. If I press Control page down key, I will move forward. And if I press Control plus page up, I will move backward. I am pressing Control plus page down to move the next sheet. Sheet one table A one. Sheet one table A one. So I am pressing Control plus page up to move back. Sheet two table A one. Now I am inserting again another sheet by pressing. Shift F11. Sheet three table A one. Sheet three. So I'm pressing page down. Sheet two table A one. Sheet two. Because I was in sheet two, so that's why sheet three has been inserted before sheet two. Now I'm in sheet two. Again, I'm pressing insert plus F11. Sheet four table A one. Sheet four. I'm pressing page control plus page up. Sheet three table A one. A one. Sh sheet three. I'm pressing Control plus page down. Sheet four table. Sheet one. four. Sheet two table. A one. Sheet two. Sheet three. Sheet four. Sheet two. Then. Sheet one table. A one. Sheet one. Okay, so I'm in sheet one. I'm pressing Insert plus sorry Shift plus F11. Sheet five table. A one. Sheet five. So I have inserted five sheets. Now. A one. I'm going to top. Now I'm pressing Control plus page down. Sheet sheet three table. A one. Sheet three. Then. Control plus page down again. Sheet four table. A sheet one. four again. Sheet two table. A one. Sheet two again. Sheet five table. A one. Sheet five again. Sheet one table. A one. Sheet one. So a one. it is not arranged like three, four, two, five, one. But it will be one, two, three, four, five, right? So how can you arrange the sheet? Now listen carefully. You can arrange. You can move the sheets only. Before and move to end, which means if you are in sheet two and you want to move the sheet two at the end, then you have the option to move to end. If you want to move the sheet two before sheet one, so you have the option to do it. You are not allowed to add any sheets after any sheet. Like if you want to add sheet two after sheet three, it is not possible. You have to add sheet two before sheet three. Now let me tell you how to move. First of all, I want to move sheet two before sheet three, right? So I need to go to sheet two. Sheet five table a one. Say sheet five. Sheet two. Sheet four. Sheet two table a one. Sheet two. So I am in sheet two. So now I can only move sheet two. Before the which sheet? Sheet number three. To do this, you have to go to the Home tab, then press O. Then you will get some options. I am pressing Alt H, then O. Ribbon tabs, cell size grouping, row height, Alt H, O H. Cell size grouping, row height. I am not telling you this right now. 
I'm pressing down arrow. Auto fit row I alt a column width width. Down arrow. Auto fit column width alt H. Auto fold width alt H. Visibility grouping. Organize sheets grouping. Rename sheet alt H. O. Move or copy sheet alt H. O. M. Alt H. O. M is the access key to move or copy any sheets. So I'm pressing enter here. Move or copy dialog. Move selected sheets. Move or copy window. Before sheet list. Sheet three one of six. Move or copy. Before dialog. sheet list, which, which means here are all the sheets available. Okay. To check the sheets, you have to use up and down arrow key. I am pressing down arrow. Sheet four two of six. Sheet four. If you press enter, then sheet two will be added before sheet four. Press. I am pressing down arrow. Sheet one, sheet sheet two, three of six, sheet five, four of six. Move to end, six of six. Move to end. There is option called move to end. If you want to move to end, you can use it. But sheet for five, now, four of six, sheet two, three, sheet four, two of six. I am using sheet three, one of six. Sheet three. So if I press enter on sheet three, the sheet two will be added before sheet three. Let's see. Oh, book one, Excel. Sheet two, table a one. I am pressing Control plus page down. Sheet three, table a one. Sheet three. Control plus page up. Sheet two table a one, a one. Sheet two. Now I need to move the sheet one before sheet two. So I'm going to sheet one. Sheet 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 five sheet one table a one. It's sheet one. So I'm going to Alt H apps, apps, O M. Self, move or copy dialog sheet three two of six. Sheet two. Create four sheet list sheet five four of six sheet one five of six. Sheet four, sheet three, two of sheet two, one of six. So I'm pressing enter here. Output one Excel. Sheet one table a one. Now let's see. A one, a, a one. Sheet sheet one table a sheet one. Sheet one. Control page plus page down. Sheet two table sheet a one. Two. Sheet three table sheet a one. Three. Sheet four table sheet a one. Four. Sheet five table a sheet one. Sheet five. Now the sheets are organized. Now think, if you have hundred plus sheets, if you some uh, sometimes if you have a sales report, a year sales report. Total sales report. So, like uh, you have, or you have the you have all the customers or, or profile in your one Excel, and you have hundred customers. You have hundred sheets, like sheet one, sheet two, sheet three, sheet four, sheet ten, sheet twenty five, sheet twenty seven, sheet ninety nine, like this. So now, one customers. Suppose you have a customer uh, named Ratul. And his sheet name, his profile's details is like his name, his phone number, his address, his email ID. Everything is sheet number forty-three. You have forgotten, right? How to how to how can you find? Tell me into the comment section. How can you find? It's not so easy. That's why you can rename your sheets. Now I am telling you how to do that. I am going to sheet one. Sheet one table a one. Now I am going to just renaming it by month wise January February. So to rename your sheets, you have to press Alt plus H plus O. Then you will get the options by pressing down arrow key. I am pressing Drip cell size grouping row I am pressing a down arrow auto fit row I alt fit. a column width alt a auto fit column width default width alt default. a visibility group organize sheets grouping rename sheet alt H O R. Alt H O R is the access key to rename the sheets. I am renaming. I am pressing enter here. Book one Excel unknown. Now I am typing the name January, and I am pressing enter. January, January table a one. January table sheet one will be renamed. Sheet one has been already renamed as January. Now sheet two table sheet two, a one. January table a one. Sheet one is not saying like uh, currently it says January because I have renamed it as January. Sheet two table. Sheet two February. I am renaming it. Trip book one. February, Feb, January, February table a one. Okay, I'm renaming it again because. February, January, February sheet three table a one. Sheet three, it's March. A no. March, March sheet four table. Sheet a two, sheet five table a one. May, May, May table sheet March a one. January, February table a one. February, March table a one. March sheet four table a two. Okay, it's sheet four. Which Ribbit, means uh, April. No. April, April table. A Sometimes two. Nvidia is not telling something like uh, Nvidia is missing. May table a one. Okay. April, March, February, January a one. Okay. So in this way, you can insert inserting a sheet and renaming a sheet. 
Now how can you delete the sheet? To delete a sheet, you have to use the access key Alt H D S. Alt H Delete. Then S for sheet. But if you want to delete any other things, then you can go to the delete dialog box. I am pressing Alt H D. Delete cells. Delete cells. Control plus Alt H D D. Control plus D. Delete cells. Met delete cells. Delete sheet rows. Alt H D. Delete sheets. Delete sheet, delete sheet rows all. Delete sheet rows. All the rows of these sheets will be deleted. Delete sheet columns all. H D C. All the sheets of these columns will be deleted. Delete sheet all. H D S. Yes, delete sheet. So I am pressing till enter. February table a one, a one. February March, March April, 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 April May table a May. one, a one. A a so one. January is missing. Now I am deleting again. The book. Ah, uh, book one Excel book April March table at a March, two April tape May table April, a one a one. May. So this is the way you can just uh, move the sheets or you can just rename the sheets, organize the sheets, insert the sheets, delete the sheets. So this is for today. See you in the next episode. I hope you can learn um, something from this episode. Please see you in tomorrow. In the next episode, till then, stay safe, take care. Bye-bye.